Hi the Roni community, we finally got in our mini model of the H1X into our facility, so I'm really excited to really show you hands-on you know, the features um, and the capabilities of the H1X and to dive in more to the design and show you how we're envisioning the H1X to work in the future. So as you can see right here from off top, very clean, very modern design, open cockpit concept. When you go to the outside, you can really see um, our patent technology is the H1X enclosed blades. As you guys can imagine, having this parked in front of your house, having open blades like a lot of companies are building it, is very unsafe and not the smart way to do it. Even though ducted fans are a lot harder to build, we believe that's really the only way this will be integrated into everyday life. It's very aerodynamic, efficiently fluid. Basically, the airflow would go around into the pushers, into the jets that will push you forward. We have two motors in each duct. So we have a total of eight vertical uh, motors, just like a drone. As you think of you go up just like a drone, vertically up. Um, and you have re a redundancy. Um, and each, you have two in each propeller. So if one fails, the other one can take over. You go up vertically like a, a drone, and then you transition into forward flight very seamlessly. So there's no tilting and there's no, um, there's not a lot of movement um, transitioning from vertical to, to forward flight. One of our major design patterns that we have um, come up with is building the, the landing gear as a wing. It generates more lift and reduces the drag on the aircraft. The whole fuselage, everything is built with aerodynamics in mind. So we want to be as efficient as possible on the battery. The goal is over here when it comes to EVTOLs, use a, the least amount of energy possible. And this is with a duct between our ducted fans and the way we've designed the, um, the whole fuselage, the whole airframe with the landing gear that will give us extra lift. So if we take a quick look in the cockpit, if we can open this. So first of all, as you can see, it's like about a 180 degree. Very simple, we'll have the luggage will actually go in the front of the vehicle. All right, this whole will be more like of a frunk. And here you'll have two seats, um, a simple joystick with a screen, very easy interface, very easy to use. Are these to, to make basically flying as simple as flying a drone or anything else? Um, you know, flying right now is very complicated, helicopters, everything like that. I just wanna make air travel something that anybody, you know, uh, with a driver license and of course it's gonna have to go through the pilot course or um, the certification to be able to fly it. Overall will be very simple. It will basically fly autonomously. All you gotta do is use the joysticks and the computers. The computers will balance out all the motors and keep you and, and give you a very comfortable and easy ride. We're really excited to show this one off. We're working now on building a full-scale model that will actually be interactive, where people will be able to sit inside, play with a virtual reality. Um, we're gonna do a tour worldwide with the aircraft, with the H1X full model, so people can get up close to it, actually feel it, touch it, and get the experience of how this would work in the real world. So thank you everybody for your support. Thank you for your investments. You know, we need a lot of help to make this happen. This is not an easy task, but you know, our, our team is very dedicated and we're very passionate about the future. Please continue supporting us. See you in the sky.